I will now brief the details of your mission orders. That's all I have to say to you right now, people. If you all really are innocent, then I suggest you prove it out there on the battlefield. We have confirmed the existence of a Yuktobanian munitions factory in the arid region of Sonza. According to our information, they have already produced a new shipment of arms that are about to be airlifted to the front by a squadron of enemy transport aircraft. Carry out an attack on the facility, and keep these transports from making their delivery. Unfortunately, this factory is well protected by a solid radar network. The network consists of a group of interlinked radar sites. If even one radar site goes offline, the system is designed to immediately report the problem to the factory. However, according to our analysis, if all four radar sites can be destroyed simultaneously, then we'll be able to delay the warning of our attack. Thanks to jamming from our electronic warfare planes, we've just managed to open up an attack corridor to the radar sites. Your squadron will split up and fly four routes. Infiltrate the area, synchronize your attacks, and destroy all four radar sites at the same time.
30 seconds to countdown. And mark. Sorry, let me make sure one more time. We need to match up the timing of the destruction, not our firing, right? I thought so. Sorry, I'm good now. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Now! Synchronized attack was successful. All right. See? Nothing to it. Let's go for the next one. Next radar cluster approaching.
This is what tactical bombing is all about, right here. Where should I attack first for maximum effect? Why didn't we have more AA guns? Archer, box two! I hit it! We're within the blast radius of the explosion. We gotta get out of here! The Yuktabanian munitions factory was destroyed, and the weapons inside the transport planes were eliminated. With this operation, we have succeeded in dealing a severe blow to the enemy's weapons production effort. Yuktabania's weapons development capability will now be lagging considerably behind Oceania.